Everyone, we are here at SHOT Show 2024. I am at the Omni Protects booth, and if you guys have been following the channel, you know I tested out one of these 3A Plus armor panels a few months ago. We shot a ton of ammo at it, and it took way more than I was expecting to get this thing to finally fail. I mean, 10 rounds of 10 millimeter of the uh, like Underwood stuff, 5.7, 12 gauge slug and buckshot, all kinds of crazy stuff we threw at this thing, and it handled it beautifully. But you guys don't just make these armor panels, you make entire vests. So can you tell us a little bit about the vest that we see here? Yeah, so OmniProtex is known um, as we're manufacturers, mm -hmm. basically. So not only do we manufacture the, the panels itself, um, but we also manufacture the vest. Mm -hmm. And what we really wanted to accomplish here was to increase comfort mm -hmm. by reducing heat. So this uh, vest you see right here is made out of mesh, extremely a lightweight mesh mm -hmm. on the inside and on the outside, so okay. you can wear it on your body and still wear your clothes over the top. Right. Um, yeah, it is, looks very low profile exactly. and very easy to conceal under just regular clothing. Yeah, so you can adjust the sizing according mm -hmm. to your body. You can make it tight or loose, mm -hmm. however you want to wear it. Sure. Um, but really what makes this product special mm -hmm. is the armor inserts. Just like you mentioned, it's a product that's capable of outperforming other level 3As. Mm -hmm. That was our goal, our intent, and it's still comfortable. It maintains its lightweight, it mm -hmm. is still flexible, and you can wear it all day for many hours without feeling fatigue on your shoulders mm -hmm. or around your body. Sure, yeah, and I mean, the reality is there's a lot of people in the armor market, and a lot of it always just seems like, a, hey, we can make that too. But one thing I appreciate about OmniProtex is not only did you do the 3A, you're like, we can do that, but also give it a little bit of extra protection that the other 3A options don't have, while still maintaining the lightweight, the, the, the malleability, so it maintains that comfort. And then, like you said, with the design of like kind of that almost moisture wicking mesh material, it's going to be more comfortable to wear for long periods of time, especially under clothes. It gets pretty toasty yeah. wearing a vest under clothes. Well, that's the issue with the industry nowadays. A lot of companies out there, they're really trying to make body armor as light as possible. Mm -hmm. but what happens when you make it light is you're sacrificing on performance. Right. So we really wanted to hit that sweet spot, not only ex you know exceeding the performance mm -hmm. by stopping rounds that are known to go through, right. but still maintaining its comfort. Right. Yeah. And the other thing too, like I know a lot of people are always like, well, I want level three or I want level four. And I get it, there are times and applications for that too. But if you look at the FBI crime statistics, the vast majority of homicides in the United States happen with handguns. And so if you're gonna be able to stop 95% of all the actual threats that you might experience on a day-to-day -day basis with something like this, even better. And again, especially for those of you who are doing a lot of armed security, but in a more low profile role, where you don't wanna be shouting from the rooftops that you're wearing body armor, this allows you to still maintain that really good level of protection in a very low profile and subtle way. Uh, I mean, I, I, I Obviously, you guys have vests like this, but are you guys looking at expanding into any other types of armor in the future? So, right now, we're specializing in level 3As. Mm -hmm. Just like you mentioned, it's more common. Right. It's more for everyday use. Mm -hmm. um, but we did come up with a whole new product. Okay. So, it's a new carrier designed to be worn outside of your outfit instead of underneath your clothes. Okay. So, for private security, law enforcement. Mm -hmm. And again, we try to minimize it because a lot of carriers out there, there's just so many, so much going on, so many unnecessary pockets, mm -hmm. adjustable straps, all of that, that we believe was unnecessary sure. that we got rid of. Okay. So we made it simpler, but not too simple. Right, yeah. simplified, but not simple is uh, how yeah, we yeah. say it in the Warhammer world, uh, <laughs> if I can expose my nerd nub there. Uh, now, obviously you've got a lot of like the bungee um, for like the cummerbund and everything. Is it kind of a one size fits most? Do you have different sizes available? So because I mentioned there is no adjustable straps at the shoulder, mm -hmm. we needed to make sure that we have a lot of sizes. Okay. And we have a lot of sizes. Yeah. From extra small all the way up to 5XL tall. Mm -hmm. So mm. yes, we. so you can even have a size medium mm -hmm. that is wider. Interesting. So if, even if someone was shorter but wider, they could still fit our armor. Right. And we also have tall options. Yeah. So really that's what we wanted to um, bring into our portfolio. Size. Okay. Well, and that's another important thing too when it comes to comfort is, again, it makes it a little bit more on your end that you have to size yourself and figure out that you're ordering the right one. But that also means when you do actually get it, it's actually gonna be comfortable. You're not gonna have excess material yeah. sticking out in all these weird places. 
having it more appropriately sized to fit your body, it's just going to increase that comfort, especially for wearing for long periods of time and that extra concealability without all this extra padding in places you don't need it. Yeah. Um, now, this is something that's currently available, like they can go to your website right now and find something like this. So this is a whole new carrier, but mm -hmm. we have in our website um, our older carrier, which okay. is very similar to mm -hmm. this. It's just a different type of mesh. Okay. But this will be on our, on our website very soon. Okay. And it'll be up and running. Within a couple of months, it'll be on our website. Okay. Um, which will be a replacement of our previous mesh. So okay. this is more durable. Okay. I think one more thing worth mentioning about our facility in general mm -hmm. is that it's made in U.S. So right. the whole body armor is made in the U.S. Mm -hmm. Not only that, it's made in a facility that is ISO certified. Mm, okay. So there are only a handful of facilities out there that is ISO certified. Right. So, well, and that's important to know too, because there's a lot of people that talk about ratings and NIJ stuff. You guys are not just NIJ rated; you're ISO rated. Like well, you. ISO in our factory. So oh, okay. that means everything that comes out of our facility is quality. Right. Yeah. So and and that's just one of those things. At, at very least. Obviously, you can watch the testing, but having that peace of mind, or especially for certain agencies that require that extra level of confidence in the products, you guys have all the bases covered as yes. far as that goes. Yes. Um, so if people want to be able to stay on top of product releases like this, or like check out that outside uh, carrier, or the panels that they've yeah. already seen on my channel, where's a good place for them to look for that? Well, of course, you can come over to our booth. Of course. 75425, located at the Caesars Forum. We can, you can always check out our website as well. We have mm -hmm. all the information on our website. Mm -hmm. And of course, call us, mm -hmm. email us. We'll always respond as soon as we can. Yeah, and I, they have an Instagram as well. That's how I was able to figure out what booth they were at to make sure I was able to come here. Uh, so I'll have links to the social media and to their, I should be able to link to their website because I don't think they have any guns on there. But if not, just search Omni Protects. You'll be able to find it. Uh, really compelling stuff. I think it's worth taking a look at. Again, they're not just another Me Too armor brand. They're actually improving what is already available on the market and I, I think making something worth taking a look at if you're looking for soft body armor. Uh, again, a really good option. Anything else you wanted to add? No, I think that's it. Okay, perfect. Well, we're going to be doing a lot more coverage here from SHOT Show 2024. I'm going to probably be testing out one of these on the channel as well here soon, so you can be looking forward to that. If there are specific rounds you want to see tested into it that we either did on the armor panel or other ammo I didn't try, let me know that. But as always, I hope you got something out of this video, and I really appreciate you watching. Thank you.